Hello everyone, Anthony Smith here. You are not alone. Put my last name in there. I was kind of weird. Haven't done that ever. But I want to talk to you something really important. And it's coming up recently more and more. Uh, last couple weeks, both Kate Spade and Anthony Bourdain, they were not that old. 55 and I believe 61 for both of them. And they both committed suicide. We're just going to jump right into this one. This is serious. And I want to bring it to the point of both these individuals were living some sort of dream, right? One was this, one of the most influential uh, designers in the world for clothing and accessories. And the other one traveled the world, met cultures, met other people, ate a bunch of food. Frankly, it seems like something that I'd want to do for my entire life, travel and eat. Like, I mean, I can't think of much better things to do than that. And... Even with those great successes career-wise, something internally made them believe that it was better not to exist than to exist. And the point I want to get across is a simple fact that happiness and joy are from within. And it's not wrong to get help. It's very important, in fact. There are many things, even in my life, that I've never really been like that intensely depressed, but even getting through certain gaps of knowledge or certain gaps of like mentality, I have a life coach, I have a trainer, because most things you can't do alone, you need some sort of guidance. You need someone that's going to be able to bring some wisdom to your life, a different angle, a different view. And for them, they probably even had that. They're one of the wealthier couple people in the world, at least not at that level. They probably had a life coach or a psychiatrist or a therapist or someone. And even then. So when it comes down to it, there's two big pieces here. And I want, people, I w I want you to really take hold of this. Even if you're not depressed, something like that, in life, do not be afraid to get advice or get help. And if it's advice you don't like, say thank you anyways they gave their effort to tell you something that they believe is correct not everything's gonna be right not all teachers are for you but thank ask like thank them for their guidance and if it doesn't work out it doesn't work out second thing find a way to find internal happiness for some people that's learning how to be present it's going down the the Zen lifestyle, you know, Buddhist, you don't have to become a Buddhist, but learning how to be present and not worry about the past or the future. Some people just find joy in what in particular hobbies or learning ways to create habits in their life that like help them bring the joy out. Some people volunteer and that's enough. Just helping another human is enough to, you know, bring them out of that depressive state so they volunteer every other day. Whatever it is you gotta do, that's not illegal, it's not hurting anyone else. That's perfectly fine. Find happiness. Find joy. But make sure it's internal. Make sure it's not reliant on someone else bringing you joy. Even on the volunteering thing, you're still kind of relying on other people to be around that you can help. What about the other times? What about when you're alone at night? You need to learn to find to love yourself, to enjoy yourself, to enjoy the moments where it's just you in a quiet room. Because those times... That's when your mind starts talking to itself. That's when your mind starts saying things that aren't even true. It starts thinking about the future, the things that haven't happened yet, and it talks about the past. Things that already happened you can't fix. There's no point in thinking about the past. It's already gone. There's no point about thinking about the future. You don't know what's going to happen yet. So enjoy every moment. And to their families... Sorry for the losses. Whatever they were going through, it must have been intense. I cannot imagine. I'm very thankful for the things I have and for the people I have around me. And I imagine they had amazing people around them in amazing situations. And even then, something tugged them away. Hope you all having a great day. I truly mean it. And I'll talk to you all soon.